Neil Smith. Thank you very much. Well, <clears throat> Taoiseach, we hear this morning in the, in the local news and the national news about the deplorable attacks on Mr Kevin Lunny, Director of the in, in Quinn Industrial Holdings. And of course, that is uh, the most recent in a spate uh, of, of attacks on the uh, staff working there. And of course, we've seen bombings too have been planted too in Wattle Bridge. And there is no doubt that the Cavan and Manon across the border is under severe pressure uh, in terms of this type of criminality. So I put it to you, Taoiseach, in terms of the recent announcement by Drew Harris about the realignment of Cavan, Monaghan and Louth, can you assure me today that both the Gardaí will have the proper resources to actually deal with these types of attacks and bring an end to it? Taoiseach. So, uh, a deputy, as you'd be aware, the uh, resourcing and organisation of the Gardaí is uh, very much a matter for the Garda Commissioner. Um, and um, when he was appointed, both Minister Flanagan and I uh, gave him the commitment that we would support him uh, in making the changes and reorganisation to the Garda force that he feels are necessary. And we fully support him uh, in the work he's doing. And the plan that he has uh, is all about making sure that there are more resources at the front line, uh, fewer chiefs, um, but many more policemen and police women on the ground. Uh, an extra 2,000 uh, on the front line uh, over the course of the next two years because of the reforms he's making, uh, because he's taking out management layers and duplication. Uh, and I hope everyone in the House will support the reforms he's driving through. Thank you, Taoiseach. Deputy Imelda Munster has